everyone! So today I'm going to do a review over several different products. These are all products that are intended to help with flat or inverted nipples for breastfeeding mothers and um, basically uh, if you watch any of my vlogs you know that I had a lot of trouble when I first started breastfeeding my son. Basically from the very first day uh, you know I had problems getting him to latch on and the nurses and the lactation consultant at the hospital told me it was because I had flat nipples. Um, so one of the first products I tried was something that the nurses at the hospital actually gave me. And it's, they are um, these things that are called soft shells by Medela. And they look like this. You guys can see that. Got little holes. And you basically just put it over your nipple you wear it underneath your bra and you have to wear it at least 30 minutes before you're feeding and the point of it is to basically draw your nipple out a little bit more um, and they also come with these different backs you put on uh, if you have um, th if you put this smaller or this wider hole back on it um, that's supposed to help if you've got sore nipples and if you've got flat or inverted ones, you put this smaller back on it. So um, we tried these first. I have no idea how much they cost, actually, um, because, you know, like I said, they were given to me at the hospital. And um, I basically didn't find these to be very helpful because, well, for starters, um, if you, for some, they just didn't stay in place. Um, you know, they didn't stay over the nipple. Like, I'd take a nap when my son would sleep in between feedings, and um, I'd wake up, and it would be, like, all the way over here. So I'd have, like, this patch of, like, flesh that was, like, sucked out, but my nipple would still be flat. So it was just, like, not really helpful in that regard. And also, they're not, I don't really feel like they're practical for everyday use. Like, just because, look, I mean, look how big they are. So that's under your bra and you're like walking around with these big bazookas pointing at everybody and <laughs> I just think it looks really really silly and I would I personally wouldn't be comfortable going around in public like that and this was just the kind of thing that you know maybe if it had actually worked um, I would have you know probably would have been worth it to wear them even if they did look silly but I just didn't find them to be all that helpful um, so when we got home we were still having issues these weren't really that helpful um, I had a lactation consultant come over and she gave me another product called the Latch Assist, which is by Lance. Now, actually, let me show you. This is the box it comes in. And it looks like this. I don't get the actual thing. And this thing is actually really cool. Um, really simple. You just squeeze it, put it over your nipple, let it suction it out, leave it on for maybe 30 seconds or so. And this is really good because, well, actually a couple of reasons. Not only does it draw your nipple out, but it also draws a little bit of milk out. So there's, you know, some milk on the tip of your nipple, and then when you offer it to your baby, they can taste it and smell it, and they're more, li more likely to start, you know, sucking if there's a little bit of milk already expressed. So that was really cool. I think that is brand new, like $13. Um, I didn't, like I said, I didn't buy mine. Um, lactation consultant, she got it for free at a midwife conference, so she just had it with her and said, here, give this a try. Uh, but I think they're around $13, and I saw them at Walgreens, and I don't know if you can get them anywhere else, but I know you can get them at Walgreens Pharmacy. Um, the only problem that I had really with that was um, my nipples were so, like, raw the first couple days, it was just really, really painful to put them in that thing. Like, I would use it, especially on the left side, and, um, like, I started bleeding. My nipples started bleeding. So, uh, yeah, it was really painful, and I actually couldn't use it for the first two weeks until I kind of got all healed up. Um, which kind of leads me to the next product that we tried still having trouble having them latch on and so I finally had it suggested to me to try a contact nipple shield um, and the kind that I use is by Medela. Size medium fits most women. Um, they're anywhere from six to eight dollars depending on where you get it. I know they're available at Target and I got mine at the hospital. 
Um, and they're not disposable. You can reuse it. You just have to wash it, um, put it in boiling water, or use warm soapy water. That's what we've done. Yeah, so basically I put this on and he latched right on and I was able to continue breastfeeding without any issues. So this was a really, really big lifesaver. Oh, and like I said, another issue obviously I have with nipples, and this is not even if you have flat or inverted nipples, this is just, you know, new nursing moms in general probably have problems with just, you know, being really irritated and raw <laughs> the first couple days and it's really painful. So some products I found really helpful for that were um, the, the Lansano Lanolin ointment. Um, it's a little bit sticky and that kind of thing, but it helps a ton. Um, this healed me up really fast and made it so that breastfeeding was, you know, really not painful anymore. Um, and then as far as, like, breast pads go, I tried a couple different things. Um, I tried uh, these, the Lansano Soothies. They're gel pads that just fit right over your nipple. Um, I think they're anywhere from $9 to 13 depending on where you get it. The cheapest I found it is um, at Target, and they were, like, $8.99 there. Um, and they're really cool. They, you know, absorb milk and it's just really cool on contact. So this in combination, these two combined, really healed me up and just soothed. You know, they're called soothies and they really do soothe. Um, these are disposable. You can use them, the box says to use them up, for t up to 72 hours. It says don't use it for longer than three weeks, but I've been using these the entire time I've been nursing just because um, every time I try to use a different kind of breast pad, I find that um, it, my nipple sticks to it, and when you go to take it off, you don't want to like peel your skin off, and I just found it to be really painful and uncomfortable. So, um, and the disposable pads that I use for these uh, Playtex Nursing Necessities, they're, you know, basically kind of the same idea as like a maxi pad for your period. You peel off the back, you stick it into your bra, and it absorbs anything that leaks out. Um, but I don't really leak that much, so, I mean, I, I really just leaked just a little bit, so, I mean, um, they stayed pretty dry, and to pull a dry pad off your nipple, it's just, it was really painful for me, so I don't really use these. Um, what else? Oh, and another product that I found extremely helpful through, um, you know, this whole issue of getting my son to latch. When we couldn't get him to latch on the left side, we used my breast pump to, um, you know, just express the milk, and um, I found that to be really, really helpful because, you know, you don't want your supply to dry up just because you're having latch issues. Um, so, especially when my milk first came in, oh my god, I like couldn't get him to, you know, eat off that side, and it was just, I was engorged, and it was really painful. So, the pump that I use is the Medela pump and style. Um, it's the little shoulder bag and um, I love it. It's amazing. Um, which, if you've already watched Jen's review, you know that, but I really like the pump. So, so I think that's all for this review. Um, if I've left anything out, I will leave it in the description. Um, if you've got any questions about any of these products, uh, just, you know, leave it as a comment. And um, I hope this was helpful to you guys. I'll see you later. Bye.